It feels good, there's outtakes too Comedy gets and flips is true So sit back, don't move too much This is the show, but you can't touch Stop, hack Thank you One perfectly polished floor Splendid Hey, you look put on, hack Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the star of the show Hacker t Dog. You're all right, cocker <laughs> Ow! Oh, don't, do, don't do it again. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the star of the show, Hacker T Dog. You all right, Cook? Oh, what's going on oh, here? For goodness sake. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the star, Hacker T Dog. You all right, Cockers? I'm Hacker the Dog, and you're watching Hacker T. Oh, 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 budgies. <laughs> Coming up, there's some of this. Plenty of this. Oh, and a bit of thing. Um, I'm damaged. Quick, Derek, play some howlers. Oh, I'm broke. You'll never guess where the butter is. Where's the boy? Your picture, sir. Where have you been? Oh, I fell off my hook. I've been here for four years. <laughs> Four years? Yes. Why didn't you just ring the doorbell? Because doorbell... Oh. <laughs> and he was... <laughs> oh, that's not funny. I'm sorry. <laughs> Load of chaos, eh? <laughs> oh, stay watching. I've got loads more funny stuff to show you later. Ain't that right, Derek? That's right, Hacker. Now look lively, lad. Today's guest is on her way. Have a look who'll be getting amongst it today. Not that she knows it yet. <gasps> it's Helen from Blue Peter. <laughs> Really, really massively and impossibly difficult and scary challenge this way. Perfect! That is exactly what I'm looking for. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome today's very special guest, Blue Peter Hair Razor, Ellen Skelton. What the special guest? Are you alright, Ellen? Oh, hi, Hacker, you alright? I'm looking for that meeting about the scary impossible challenge thingy. You know, I really think it's time that I climbed Everest. I've never jumped out of a plane and oh, I saw no, a no. set what... No, 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 it's much harder than that, Ellen. Perfect. Do you know what? I am so glad that you are up for me doing a scary challenge. It's like no one encourages me yeah. to do well, these well, things. Well, calm yourself. You'll have to wait, Helen. We've got some stuff to do first. You're today's guest on my show. Guest? Show? Yeah. I don't know if I've got time, the thing is I've got the dog to walk and I've got like scary things don't to Don't worry find. Ellen, you'll love it, it's a dead good show in that and I smell much better than that Barney. I would. Alright, well I'll stick around for a bit but only if you promise to tell me about this scary, impossible, crazy challenge that you've got lined up. Because yeah, 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 I'll tell you, sure. But before that, watch this. It's a fat file thingy about you. Push that red lever. Helen Skelton presents Blue Peter and is best known for liking big, hairy challenges. Helen's always doing lots of amazing daredevil antics and that, like breaking two world records rowing down the Amazon River, running three marathons back to back in the Namibian desert, and most of all, cleaning a chair. What's she up to? What's all that about, eh? What's she like? It's Helen Skelton. What was that chair thing all about, Helen? It's not a chair, it's a throne for royalty, and I was cleaning it with spit. Oh, like this? No. Oh, like that. that would be disgusting. Yeah. You lick a cotton bud and then you polish it. Oh, get all the filth from. Yeah. Now, Helen, you're an adventurer, aren't you? You could say that, yeah, I guess so. I did say that. What's yeah. wrong with you, madam? Anyway, mm -hmm. I could do adventuring better than you. Oh, you think so, do you? Watch and learn, little lady. Watch! And indeed, you will learn. Welcome to the Betterer Arena. Today, I'm betterizing adventure in several death-defying steps. Step one. The guy about your sat-navs, this is a finely tuned instrument. 
It can smell out anything. Mad servant, hither. Blindfold me. Oh, it's a bit tight, that, isn't it? Calm yourself down. What are you doing? I'm going to prove myself by sniffing out this priceless Ming vase filled with stinking flowers. It's a one-off, you know. Right, here we go. <laughs> sniff. <laughs> sniff, sniff. Ow! Oh! Right in the face, that got me. I'm not going to go. Sniff, 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 sniff. Don't you have find it? Clever boy, good boy. Yeah, what's going on? Help me, my servant, I'm frightened. Step two. Yeah, well, I've had a bit of a block now, so I'm weak, so that's why that can... Now, I think adventuring should be made more easy going. Why? What do we have here? It's a picture of some sort of Mother Nature thing at her very best. And look who we've got. Why, it's me, little old hacker. Hello, I'm the hacker, and I'm going to go for a jump over the Grand Canyon. Oh, no. Little hacker, it's fallen off his stick. Why did this have to happen? He was so young. He had everything to live for. Ah, I, I'm aghast. Step three. Wow, that was sad. Moving on, the last thing I'm going to do to be an ultimate adventurer is invent a new extreme sport. So I give you extreme... Uh, ah, Ming vase dusting. Yes, oh, look at its pricelessness. Oh, yeah, it's another one off, you know. Ha, 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 he, who, ha, Uh-oh. Oh, no, I'm stuck amongst the maze again. Oh, there's a spider in here. Uh, get it off me nose. I'm not sure that counts as adventuring. The only thing you explored was the bottom of a few vases. I know! Good, isn't it? <laughs> now, Helen, we know you from Blue Peter, right, where you do all those good challenges. Well, what's the hardest challenge you've done? Probably downhill skateboarding. It was so painful, you know, I nearly broke my legs. That's not right, is it? No. I tell you what, my favourite one was the Amazon one we did. You remember? We had a right old lol doing that, didn't we? We? I didn't see you in the jungle. Helen, how could you forget that? I was there all along with you. Have a look. Press that baton. I've been going five hours. It's red hot. I've been up since half me. I'm tired. The magnitude of what I've taken on finally hits me. You all right, Helen? What are you crying for? This Amazon thing's a right old doddle, isn't it? I've been up and down the river three times already. Bye-bye! Woohoo! <laughs> like it? <laughs> now, listen. Helen Skeleton, right? I Me wish you had have been what? there. That was real, wasn't it? <laughs> I missed you. Ah, oh, you. Helen Skeleton. Me and you are Shelby's friends, of course. But the people at home might want to know more about you. So I'm going to ask you some interesting <laughs> questions, like a proper presenter would do. OK. What is your favourite cheese-based foodstuffs? Uh, toasted sandwich. With cheese in? Yeah. Yeah. When was the last time you stroked an hedgehog? I don't know why I'm answering these like a quiz. I'm like, uh, I've never done that. It would hurt. Uh, do you like wool? Wool, 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 wool. <laughs> I love wool. I've got a handbag made out of lamb's wool. Oh. Is your dog Barney as talented as me? Look, I can do this, look. <gasps> he can put his leg behind his head. Oh, right, this one's good one. Have you ever been... Oh, excuse me. Oh. Have you ever, um... Oh. Have you ever done that... Oh, stop it, Jim, please. Have, have you ever... Right. Stop, stop it! Ah! <laughs> Oh, hacker, stop asking Helen stupid questions and ask her something proper. Hey, calm down and listen to my joke. <clears throat> what did Helen Skelton say to Barney the dog? I do not know. <laughs> Look out or you'll get hit in the face. I don't get it. <laughs> oh.
Pizza! Oh, yes, yeah, that's better. Thanks, Ellen. Now, what was I talking about? Was it something to do with Belgians? Nothing to do with Belgians. You were about to tell me about this idea. The idea for my crazy, impossible, scary challenge. Now, come on, let me have it. What is it? No, it wasn't that, Ellen. Uh, oh, never mind, I've forgotten. I'll tell you what, though. We could watch some clips of you going wrong and that. No! Wrong answer! Run it! <laughs> Taking off half the pain. <laughs> oh! Well, I tell you what, I'll lick it off. <laughs> oh, I've snapped the needle. <laughs> dress made entirely of balloon. <laughs> As stylist, I'm in charge of the clothes, so I've come to Vogue's secret... <laughs> One more. A few hours ago, this was just a pile of metal and plastic, but now... <laughs> She's alive. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, this really is an incredible venue. I have got no idea what I'm saying, sorry. I do like it. Rose, <laughs> is he in the back of shot? He's not squeezing one out, he's squirting one out. Oh, nice. <laughs> oh, that does do, he's toxic. Let's keep walking, stinky. I reckon she can jolt a pogo stick. <laughs> right, now I was very lucky enough. <laughs> yes! That's why we don't give Joel the fruit a pogo stick. <laughs> what a lull! Oh, can we move on, please? No, oh, Quickly. Hey, seeing all that adventure stuff makes me want to know more. So I'm going to ask you three quick fire questions, and I want you to give me three quick fire answers. <gasps> okay. Spotlight, please, Herman. Oh, easy. Okay. Are you ready? Yes. Go! What is the weirdest place you've ever been to? An oil wrestling festival in Turkey. What one luxury item do you always take with you on your adventures? False eyelashes. Do an adventure pose. I'm scared. Do it, do it, do it. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> Good answers. But I want to know what the real people of the world have to say about adventuring. I'm off. Hurrah! <laughs> Well, what do you know? I've only gone and found my way down the road to this place here, where them little children do those things with that stuff, with the other people who do the other things and that. And I need answers to my questions. So let's get in there and find out what they think. I bet they'll be glad to see me. Get out! You're not welcome in here! No. You're filthy well, well, animals! Well, those little children were rude, and they weren't so little either, come to think of it. Let's go and speak to some others. Hello, everyone. Hello. Now, listen, I'm going to ask you some questions today, um, and we'll find out about adventuring. What is the weirdest place that you've ever been to? The Dungeon Museum. Was it scarier than this face? Yeah. <laughs> Where is the weirdest place you've ever been to? My dad's kitchen. Your dad's kitchen? <laughs> I've been to Narnia. You've not been to Narnia? Oh, yes, I have. Germany. Germany? Have you been to Germany? Yeah. Can you, uh, can you speak German? Yeah. Go on, then. Ich war in Deutschland. What does that mean? I've been to Germany. I know you just told me that, but what does it mean? <laughs> <laughs> if you went to a place, right, and you could only take one luxury item, what would it be? Um, a camera. A helicopter. A phone. TV. A TV? What would you watch on it? Your show. My show! The correct answer, that's right. You would watch Scoop, wouldn't you? Yeah. And Hacker Time. And all my other top-notch shows. Hello! Hi! Now let's all do our adventurous pauses. What are you doing? What is that? Table Taking tennis. Through the jungle. Now what are you doing? Taking a picture. <laughs> so you're going one hand on your hip, aren't you? And you're going, he was at me. I just found treasure. You found treasure? Can I have some? Yeah, sure. I've got Hurrah! Loads. Ah, you're doing this now. What are you doing? I'm thinking about where to land my helicopter. Ah, and have you got any plans? Where are you thinking of putting it? There's a flat bit over there. A flat bit over there? Yeah. There's a flat bit. 
over there. So bear that in mind. What are you doing? Looking through. Looking what is it? Looking through a telescope. What have you seen? Not much. Did you see that flat bit for the helicopter? Yes. So we're working as a team. We've learned that, if nothing else. We have learned today a lot about adventuring. We've learned that these guys have been to their dad's kitchen, to a waxworks and up a tower. And if they had to take something with them, they would take their mum, a mobile phone and a helicopter. And we've all learned how to do an adventure pose. Hit it. There we go. Thank you very much and goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you. Oh, look at that lovely shiny big red button. That looks like it would benefit from a nice old push. But oh, I do not push every time. Why can't I push it? What arm would it do? Hello? Right, Axe. What are you up to? Uh, nothing, nothing. I wasn't going to do it. Do what? Oh, oh I bet. Uh, uh, nothing. Oh, how's the show going? Oh, it's going right good and that. I just went to speak to some people and that, yeah. So shiny. Hey? Nothing! Now look, Hacks, I just called to tell you something really important. Oh, yeah? Yeah, look, it's really, really important. Are you listening? Yes, I am, yeah. Right, whatever you do, yeah. don't push the... <laughs> uh, oh, uh, Dodger? Yeah? Uh, if I had pressed the button, uh, what, what would have happened? <laughs> well, it takes about ten seconds. And then it releases a cage full of lions into my kennel. <laughs> Ooh, um... You didn't press the button, did you? Ah, no, Mr. Lion. Oh, oh, and you don't Ow! Here we go. Hacko, is everything all right? You look a little bit dodgy. Dodge! I haven't spoken to him in days, months, years! In fact, I don't know who he is. It's nothing to do with me. I what, didn't what, press anything, whoa, it wasn't whoa, me. Whoa, 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 what are you on about? Oh, uh, ooh, uh, n nothing, no, nothing at all. <sighs> right, come on, is it time yet for my scary, impressive, crazy challenge? Because I am dying to hear what these ideas you've got for me. Oh, no, no, that's later. I'm going to do a challenge before that, too. Still to come today. This. This. And this. Who are they? What are they doing in there? They're not on today. Quick, show some adventure howlers, Derek. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. adventurers have inspired our very own hacker to do a death defying challenge hacker yeah. i can't believe you're gonna do this well believe it love because i am a hair raising adventurer i shall be shot from inside this cannon across the skies and into the waiting arms of danny harmer from tracy beaker well i take my hat off to you because this is intense you must have been training for months nah it looks easy will you light the fuse please i'm on it Oh, I mean, this is unbelievable. You're going to be flying through the air. Who knows where you're going to land? And look at you. You've got a little white costume on. You've got no protection. Stop it. Stop it, Alan. I can't Stop it. Run me out. I'm lifting. It's going to blow. I've changed my mind. It's too late. Budgie. Look at the size of that. The Tower of Pizzas. We're in a valley You do look me, Janine. Oh. Daddy, 
Danny, where are you? Oh, Danny. Oh, oh Hacker. Are you all right, buddy? You went for miles. Of course I'm all right. You look nice, Mummy. Have you done something new with your hair? Hacker? He'll be all right in a minute, I'm sure. Hacker, just give him a minute. He better be all right anyway, because he has got to tell me about this crazy, impossible, mad challenge. He's been teasing me with it all day. Hacker? Hacker? I'll look after him, don't worry. Right, uh, Herman, what's next? Oh, geez. <laughs> Apparently, we're going to watch something that's about dogs in space. It's meant to be the best thing on telly with two dogs in space. I think I'll be the judge of that. Derek, will you press play? Oh, heck, uh, run them. Ladies and gentlemen, the Leicester Advanced Space Agency welcomes you to this mission launch. The two finest astronauts in the program are flying this vital mission. Counting down. In five, four, and a one! <laughs> Is it our business class on rocket? Stewardess! Uh, you didn't have to fly this thing, right? Yeah. Todd? Bob? This is Flight Director Chuck at Mission Control. Great luck. Yeah. Hang on. You're not Todd and Bob. Help! Help us! Help! Oh, we uh, never mind them two. Where are you now? Affirmative. The mission must continue, even if it is you two rats instead of astronauts. Chicky mooey. Hey, what's the mission then? Head to a far off planet called Farquhar. Farquhar. It has a rare alien life form on it. We need to learn about its advanced technology. The aliens are green, easy to miss, so whatever you do, don't land on them. Mission Control, out. Sounds dumb somewhere nice then, Dodge. I've brought a picnic. Oh, hey, what about that big soft green patch? Yeah. Perfect. <laughs> what was that squish? Now, what did they say that alien looked like? <laughs> like that! Oh, budgies! Back away slowly, Dodge! <laughs> Guys, any luck finding that alien? Oh, I'm not going to lie to you, Chuck. There was nothing there. Barren it was. Oh, uh, yeah, a uh, bleak, uh, desolate even. Yeah, so we should probably just set our phases for underwhelmed and head home. An amazing discovery, guys. The flight of the Beagle must continue. Your work isn't done. Nobody to laugh, laugh. Oh, space budgies. And off they go to continue their voyage. But they'll be back to make a complete mess of it again soon. When we return to dogs in space. Are you sure you are right, Hacker? Yeah, I've never felt better, Barney. It's Helen. Blonde Helen. Hey, wasn't Dogs in Space good and that? Yeah, it was good, but I mean, Hacker, the thing is, you have been promising me this entire show that you've got a scary, impossible, crazy challenge for me. It must be time now. I mean, come on, come on. Is it parachuting? Is it, is it, oh, I've got it, I've got it. It's wrestling with crocodiles, isn't it? Oh, no, it's harder than no, all of that. No, I definitely know what it is. I definitely know. It's ice climbing, isn't it? it no, it, it's harder than that. Go over there and get ready. Yeah. Even harder. Ladies yeah. and gentlemen, witness the most difficult and tough challenge ever in that. Watch as Helen Skelton, brave telly woman, opens a jar of pickled onions that I've not been able to get into for weeks. Wow. Dog, is this it? What do you mean? That's the hardest thing I've ever tried to do. I can't shift that lid. It was hardly even attached. I mean, I could have blown that off with a little... Still, at least we've got some pickled onions to eat. Do you want one? Oh, no, I don't like them. They mock them things. Right, Ellen, that's the end. Thanks for coming in. There's a present here for you. Have a look. It's a Hacker Time Dog Bowl. The Hacker Time Dog Bowl is the latest in doggy sheep. It's based on the newest dog bowl designs coming from Paris and Milan and is 97% new. <laughs> there you are. 
I tested it last night by eating my din dins out of it and it works a treat. What do you think? It does smell like chicken, but yeah, cheers, I guess. That's Thanks. all right. Now off you pop, Ellen. See you. I've got stuff to be getting on with. The door's there. Well, I mean, that's me done? That's your done, yeah. Oh, right. OK, well, all right then. Thanks. See you, man. your head. Oh, dinner. <laughs> right. Now she is cleared off. Let's take a look at some of my favourite all-action lols from around the world. This is Hacker's Top 5 Adventure Howler. <laughs> In at five. There's a right nonsense going on at number five. Pull left, pull left, pull left, pull uh, left. I'm pulling left. Pull left and push. <laughs> and I've landed in a tree. <laughs> <laughs> My first unbelievable high okay, flight. Give me field like this. At four, more tree based nonsense. Oh, that's a lovely shot. Eight mind it. Oh! oh, let's see that again. All oh, right, in the fam squad. Never mind, lads. Three. In at three is a girl doing a bit of zarbing. That's when you try and walk in a big ball thing. But she's poor at it. <laughs> Here she goes. Nice and easy. Oh, love, you're falling down. Have another go. Come on. Yes, it. Oh, forget it. Don't bother, love. It's riddled with aquatic chaos. <laughs> Two. In at two is this woman who's proper scared of roller coasters and that. Listen to her scream. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh hey, nice, sir. And at one, my number one howler today is a boy stuck on an inflatable. How do they get him off it? Have a look. There he goes, up the ladder there. Nothing unusual about this, you might think. But what? Oh no, he's jumped way moisture. He went flying, didn't he, Tarquin? So, oh yeah. Um, that's all for today from Hacker Time. I'm off now to Posh Spice for a biryani. Thanks to Helen Skelton for telling us all about adventuring and that. Oh, what a show we've had. I'm going to reminisce about it now in the form of a song. Goodbye. That is it for now, the end of the show. I need the laugh laugh, so I'm going to go. I'll see you next time on this show of mine. Put it in your diary, it's called Hacker Time. We've had a lot or two watching some clips. I laughed so hard that I nearly was sick. I'll show you more funny stuff when I'm next on. Who needs other telly shows? Mine's the best one. I was shot out of a cannon and Helen was my special guest. We had lots of fun and that, but all that tired me out. Now I need a rest. But oh, that is it for now, the end of the show. I need the love, love, so I'm going to go. I'll see you next time on this show of mine. Put it in your diary, it's called Hacker Time. Put it in your diary, it's called Hacker Time. That is the end of today's Hacker Time. Thank you. Jump into the action this half term on CBC. Here we go. Bring it on. It may feel really good that you've done something to help save a species. What are you waiting for? <laughs> we got it! Oh, let's go wild. The thing is in the house. Let's see how many lives you have left. Doesn't that look amazing? <laughs> shot on a clown hat. I don't know, we're just the clowns you're looking for. Let's go. Jump into the action this hot term. Today from 7, only on the CBBC channel.